Hi, I'm the Scrub, and you're here for one reason. Oh, I didn't realize we were fighting my ex. Oh, it's just called the Manipulator. Oh, thank heavens, I really didn't want to see her again. So I hear that the plan is that we're going to try and shut down the heart of Alexander. Just like my ex, I'm convinced that this thing doesn't have a heart either, but there's only one way to find out. Time to learn about the burden of the father. Simplified. Tanks will start attacking one of the two legs that are targetable. Focus that one down first. Hydrothermal missile is a tank buster. One party member will get an electric blue orb above their head. There'll be two spots in the arena where several yellow electric orbs will periodically spawn in and start gravitating towards that player. When the orbs are in close proximity to this player, they will explode in a small AoE. Other players will need to run into these orbs and absorb the damage before they reach the targeted player. If you do this, make sure you only take one or two orbs, as taking three or more without healing could potentially kill you. AoEs will be placed at the feet of random party members called Seed of the Sky. Just dodge out of it to avoid being hit by it. The the manipulator will start casting Emergency Quarantine. When this cast finishes, the off-tank and one DPS will be collected in a vent and sent to a platform where you'll fight one Panzer Doll. The doll just does auto attacks and small tank busters. Defeat the doll to return to the party. These mechanics will repeat until one leg has been defeated. When you defeat the first leg, the manipulator itself will become targetable. You will only have a short time to get its health down as much as possible. When it becomes untargetable, it will cast Mortar Revolution, which is a big room-wide AoE. The other leg will be replenished back to full health and will become targetable again. Three bits will appear around the edge of the arena and tether themselves to one player. The manipulator will start casting Carnage. You can Reduce the damage to your fellow party member by intercepting this tether by moving between the bits and the player who is tethered. When the cast finishes, the bits will shoot a small AoE at the players who are tethered. Three Jagged Dolls will spawn in on the edge of the arena and start attacking random players. When they get to the person they are targeting, they will instantly cast a colorful AoE around themselves which will give everyone in the vicinity a stack of luminous etherplasm. If you get four stacks of this, you will instantly explode in an untelegraphed medium-sized AoE called Exhaust, which will instantly kill you and everyone else around you. It's best to focus down the Jagged Dolls the moment they spawn in. Players can also be hit with Quarantine in this phase as well. These mechanics will repeat until the second leg has been defeated. When you defeat this leg, the manipulator will become targetable again for a few seconds before casting its roomwide AoE again. From here, you can burn down the manipulator. The quarantine mechanic and Jagger dolls will not reappear in this phase. Several bits will spawn around the edge of the arena and begin casting Carnage Zero. This will cause small AoEs to chain between players. Just spread out slightly so you won't get hit by several AoEs and healers be prepared to throw out a regen or an AoE heal. Judgment Nisi will target both healers with a 5 stack of a debuff. Either a blue buff, which is Nisi A, or a red buff, which is Nisi B. These stacks will slowly start ticking down every few seconds and also give a small dot tick. If you run through or stand pretty close to another player, you will give that player the same colored debuff. That debuff on them will have their stacks reset to 5 and again, slowly tick down. If a player gets stacks of both red and blue, they will gain final sentence and instantly die. So anyone who gets a colored debuff will need to stay away from everyone with the opposite debuff to make sure that you don't delete each other. The manipulator will repeat the orbs, bits, AoEs, Judgment Nisi and tethers until it is defeated. Congratulations, you have beaten the raid series of Alexander Gordius. My name is The Scrub, thank you for watching.